What's up, I Like Scary? We are back. I hope you're all having an awesome day. I'm having an awesome day. It feels great to be a horror fan. So you all, moments ago, we just got some news over on Deadline and Bloody Disgusting about Lauren Levera returning to Terrifier 3 to reprise her role as Sienna. And this is some great news. I mean, we kind of already knew. I mean... Her story could have been over, but it also couldn't have because we got a lot of backstory. We were learning about their dad, you know, Jonathan and Sienna. So it was a lot of stuff still to be told. But it's just cool to have it confirmed. And we got some stuff with this um, interview with Lauren Rivera with Damien's talking about with Terrifier 3 and some pre-production going on. But before we get into it, definitely smash the like button because it definitely helps. So you all, over on Bloody Disgusting, we get some more info about Lauren Rivera returning as Sienna and Terrifier 3. And we all know this is going to be a Christmas slash, so this is going to be very cool. And, um, yeah, so to get into it, over on Bloody Disgusting, it basically says that um, now as the story unfolds and creator Damien Leone's Terrifier 3 Levera is back to lead through your deepest nightmares when Arthur Clown unleashes chaos on the unsuspecting residents of Miles County as they peacefully drift off to sleep on Christmas Eve. So, you guys, we got to kind of like, you know, basically a little small synopsis right there about terrifier three miles county saying that this is going to be going taking place on christmas eve so definitely gives you a little grinch feel gives you the grinch uh feel and everything so also saying i'm thrilled to be returning to terrifier three said lavera damien's vision for my character was special and now he's set to take it to an entirely new level it's been surreal to witness the immense connection and support from fans for sienna and i applaud damien for introducing a strong female character the angel dressed heroine who gets the face off against art the clown merciless ways i can't wait for you to see the next chapter of Sienna as Damien dives deeper into her backstory. Lauren was the heart and soul of Terrifier 2. And the next installment could be done without her character, said Leone. Lauren brings an unparalleled essence to the film and her return is integral to the continuation of the chilling narrative we've crafted. Her character will be more developed as she is dealing with intense trauma stemming from the events of a previous film and eventually she must conquer these challenges to confront art. Her continued metamorphosis into art's formidable foe is one of the most intriguing and exciting aspects of this franchise for me. And basically saying that uh there were that deadlines also reporting that David Howard Thornton, of course, he will be back, and Chris Jericho will be back. Samantha Scaffody and Elliot Fullman also reprising his role. Man, this is crazy. We already knew this, but this is crazy. And then saying Leone uh saying basically we are in a pre-production right now. We're going to start uh shooting in two months, beginning of February. So we're in the thick of it. We're assembling our crew, we're still casting, we're getting location in order, special effects are being created, and we're still working on drafts. It could always be better and tighter. I've never stopped doing that all the way through production. I'm finally getting to the stage where I'm ex very excited about it. We're about to make a movie again, which is my childhood fantasy come true. He also um, previews that this is one's going to pick up where part two left off in a sane asylum so you're going to see what transpires there what mayhem unfolds because seeing how art and victoria ended up is so insane and seeing how they get out of the situation and what happens next is going to be really wild so we have to go chris we have to get chris jericho back in there and see how it becomes a part of that situation so this is crazy, guys. So we, we get some a lot of info, actually, with Terrifier 3, a huge update. So we get the, co the confirmation of Sienna coming back uh, and then Elliot and, and, and just so much info with Damien talking about Terrifier 3, how now they're in pre-production and filming starts in February of next year. So they're in the thick oven and stuff, still tightening up drafts and everything. And they kind of just give us a rundown again about how this will take place it will literally pick up from where terrifier 2 ended which is an insane asylum we saw that crazy scene with victoria and everything with art's head and it was kind of threw me off man very crazy so i cannot wait to see how that continues from there it definitely is going to be interesting to see how that picks up and they get out of it and they're bringing chris jericho back a lot of people wanted to see chris jericho die i want to say his death they had deleted it he did die but they ended up deleting it but um to push through, we find out more about Lauren Lavera, you know, Sienna's uh, character, basically saying that uh, 
with her character in the next one that she's going to be still trying to deal with her trauma from what happened in previous events in Terrifier 2. And she's going to have to return and go back to art and deal with that because it's basically eating her alive and stuff like that. And um, his exact words was saying she is dealing with uh, intense trauma stemming from events of the previous film. Eventually, she must conquer these challenges to confront art. Her continued metamorphosis into art's formable foe is one of the most intriguing and exciting aspects of this franchise for me so yes i do love sienna man she is a final girl in my eyes she does such a great job as sienna um i can't wait to see jonathan um i'm thinking jonathan's going to be the one that's in college and it's saying that this this story is going to take place on christmas eve and art's going to come terrorize some shit in, on christmas eve so that's going to be very interesting and um yeah man I, I really can't wait to see what happens with everything with this so yeah man they're talking about some more stuff with the sane asylum and everything and i can't i'm glad that they're actually picking up from terrifier too that's the way to do it pick up from terrifier to and explain more to us what's about to happen and everything um i don't know man i see a lot of people out there saying that jonathan might not make it to the fourth one if they do one but uh, I, don't, I could see Jonathan making. He kind of kept his head above water in Terrifier too. But he was getting his ass jacked up about art, um, you know, towards the end. But it's so cool to get some news finally, some big news from Terrifier Three. They've been actually updating, as a matter of fact. But you know what I'm saying? But yeah, saying what mayhem unfolds because seeing how Art and Victoria ended up. It's so insane and seeing how they get out the situation and what happens next. I cannot wait to see how they get out this asylum. He said it's going to be wild. He's teasing that, you know, this is going to be brutal. One of the most brutal uh, Terrifier films. I'm not going to lie. I don't see how that's going to happen after seeing Terrifier 2. But I'm all excited for it, man. Sienna and Art's story continues. Hopefully we get some info on her dad and the backstory. It's something going on with that journal for sure. And knowing Damien is something that's going to be very connected with this story. And I can't wait. You know, weeks ago, we got some updates on the cast and everything. So knowing info about this cast and, and now putting the story together, this definitely is going to be a good one. I cannot wait for Terrifier 3 next year. It's my most anticipated uh, horror film. And, yeah, I can't wait to see how they up arts kills and the brutalness. I can't wait to see how Lauren Lavera decides to try to figure things out, what she's going through with this trauma from previous events with art. I want to see what's going to happen with Jonathan, the new settings. We're hearing that's going to be on college grounds, uh, Christmas. It's going to be crazy. It, it's really it's, it's sounding like a great movie. So big shout out to these guys, man. I'm all for this. And um, yeah, man, I can't wait. I will be covering more things, Terrifier 3, as we get more updates. But yeah, you guys, comment down below what you all think about all this info we got about Terrifier 3. And yeah, you all, unfortunately, it's the end of the video. I want you guys to hit me up on my social medias. I like scary on Instagram. I like scary underscore on TikTok. Brand out on Facebook. I like scary on Twitter. And yeah, you guys, right there where it says subscribe. Next week, click join and become a member of the channel. I want you guys to watch some horror movies. Stay scary out there. I love you all. Peace. Until next time.